What is up guys? Welcome back to another video. There's some things that people don't know about flat packs inside of, you know, Linux itself. So let's try to enlarge this and let's go over a few things real quick, okay? Flat packs are super easy to deal with. If you already have some installed and you want to check if there's an update, you do flat pack update and it's there. Say you want to find an application. What is an application that I would want to find? Huh? simple one is discord and doing this will pop up every single discord alternative in the universe by the way qt lord qt qt cord dacord's the best one honestly if you're on nvidia use dacord and then you got all the rest of them here it's kind of interesting how many there are in the world so many discord clients oh there's gilded great alternative to discord by the way all those features that you pay for on Nitro are free on Gilded. Yeah, plus they don't uh, try to kill you for theming it, which is great. What is this? What is this? Okay, I need to turn this down. This is just ridiculous. Uh, ultra fast paced arena shooter, alien arena. Okay, you find something you like. You can do flat pack install and we're going to do alien arena. And hit yes and then hit yes again it's installed and done now if you don't want something it's as easy as doing flat pack remove and then the application name and if you don't know what the application's name is we'll get to that in a second after this is done downloading why do flat packs not have the best download speeds oh my for those who didn't see my community post um i'm going through some stuff at the moment and i'm gonna try to push through it but uh, it is a bit difficult for me right now. And I don't want to really talk about it, but that's as much as I'll do. So yeah, uh, I don't really sound like myself and I'm going through some dizziness and anxiety and other stuff. It's normal. It happens to people. Okay, so Discord. So doing, dis doing flat pack list shows you everything you have installed. Okay, so if you don't want something, you can copy this name. And then you can type flat pack remove and then the name of what you want to remove on this side the application id but i actually want to go check out alien arena and it's on my wrong monitor great job so far um how do we make it go to the other monitor sounds pretty cool though there's a video mode yeah all it did was destroy the application when i tried to move it over alt f4 that that's sad that's sad i really wanted to play that why does it do that all right back to flat packs uh you can also do i believe help and this allows you to do anything you can even run them from the terminal override make current enter ps kill Install, update, uninstall, mask, pin, list, info, history, config, repair, create USB. Oh, oh that's pretty cool. And then there's the search one. And there's just, you can manage, you know, permissions and remote add and stuff like that. Flat packs are very simple and easy to use. Most people don't trust them. I don't understand why. You I mean, you get complete freedom over what you want it to access and what you don't. But yeah, there it is. That's just a short, simple little video on how you can better use flat packs on Linux. And yes, this applies to any distro with flat packs, not just Fedora 40. All right, subscribe, like the video, share the video. I'll see you guys in the next video. And don't forget to have a great day and stay safe and do stuff and, and smile and hold the people you care about. Yeah, it's always important. Bye, everyone.